One of the quickest ways that we can verify information that we find on social media is by doing something called reverse image search. So just like you can type a question into Google or your favorite search engine or a fact to see it's been published before, you can ask search engines to look at a photo that you upload and to look for similar photos elsewhere on the internet and to see if it's been published before or there are other ones that look like it that can help you piece the puzzle together. And there are many search engines that help you do this. There's obviously Google reverse image search. Tinai is another really good one. Um, Bing has a really powerful visual search function where you can upload a photo and then prioritize just a part of that image. So for example, if the image you're trying to verify has a really distinctive mural or a building or a mountain, um, you might be able to find photographs of that same place just because it's looking at that specific icon or that building. Yandex looks more at the kind of Russian space of the internet and Baidu looks more at the Chinese space of the internet. And all of these search engines have got different algorithms. So sometimes one of them won't find anything, but the other one will find a couple of results. And that's where that detective work of piecing the clues of the puzzle together comes into play. The other way that you can do reverse image searches is by using a plugin. So there's um, Revi reverse image search then builds the search function of reverse image search into your browser. And it means that wherever you are on the internet, you just control click and it'll let you immediately send it to all of these different search engines. So you don't even have to remember what they're called or type it into your browser or open up different tabs. It'll do it for you. I'm originally from Monterrey, Mexico, and I know my countrymen can be very creative when it comes to how we name our children. I used to babysit this kid called Anakin. Yep like Star Wars. So I thought this was really funny and I'll confess that I immediately shared it with a couple of friends and family and loved ones before I even did any checks. And it, just as soon as I did it, my alarm bells went off to think, hold on a second, what if it isn't true? I've actually never heard of El Norte Football before. Why don't we do a reverse image search just to see if I can debunk it that way or figure it out, right? So this is the original tweet and you can see it there. And because I have the plugin installed, I can control click on any of it and then send it to reverse image search and send it immediately to all search engines. You can see how now it's opened up all of these tabs on my browser. I didn't even have to think about it. And it's immediately asking all of these different search engines to look for either that specific picture or pictures that look like it. So Google has immediately decided to tell me that it, a possible related search for this is baby in civil registry, which just goes to show it kind of knows what it's about. And it's found it in a couple of different Mexican government websites that are using it almost like a stock image. You can see that that is exactly the same picture just without the black kind of mark over the baby's eyes. And it's been used before 2019, 2016, here it is in a meme um, website from 2016. So obviously I fell for what was meant to be a funny satirical tweet and shared it without the right context. And I had to go and apologize and correct myself to the people that I'd already shared it with. If we look at some of those other search engines, for example, in this case, um, Bing didn't really find um, the same image, but it found a couple of the other stories that are using it. Yandex was able to find more of the meme pages that have been sharing it before, so some of the older meme pages. Tenai went straight to all of the different Mexican government websites that have used this stock image before, and look at how far back it's been in existence, 2014. So definitely not Dylan COVID named in honor of um, the coronavirus. Um, and Baidu in this particular case didn't really find much, but, um, but it just goes to show how all of these results are different depending on the platform that searches for it and that it's worth doing a search across to make sure that you found the answers that you needed. You can also very quickly do this on your phone. So I've just recorded myself doing this exact same process. You look at Twitter, you go, oh, this is an interesting story. Save the photo to your camera roll. And this works exactly the same whether you're on iPhone or on Android. Open up tinai.com, upload the image, check through the results, and you would have gotten the exact same answer. So reverse image search, the first thing we should all do, myself included, to avoid having to either correct ourselves or spread dangerous disinformation. Wow.